In today's video, I'll be using an app called Spots. It's been described to be the travel guide of the visual generation. Spots will help you explore like a local expert. It features 13 cities from around the globe with hundreds of unique locations to visit. It's a free download, so if you're interested to check this out for yourself, then be my guest. This video is sponsored by Squarespace. Whether you need a domain, website, or online store, make it happen with Squarespace. How was your breakfast? Good? Oh, it was brilliant, bro. Good breakfast? Decent, thank you. <laughs> great. We had a big day ahead of us, so Weatherspoons was a great start to the day. So this is what the app was called. It's called Spots, amazing photo locations. Uh, if we just open that up, it brings up a map of where we are and also comes with these pinpoints where you can find great photography spots. Uh, it shows you how far away they are and what the potential picture could look like. So I thought today we'd go around all these different spots and take some cool pictures. We started off in East London and Tower Bridge was first on our list. We're here, let's find a cool shot. How do we do that? By walking around and looking. So I'm gonna get a quick picture of Jay walking down the stairs. But the trouble is, it's very busy around this area. So we're gonna have to wait till it clears up a little bit. All right, Jay, come through. Jay, I think the audience will be asking, where did you learn your moves? American Next Top Model, baby. <laughs> <laughs> so this is the exact location where they're showing us the recommended picture. It looks like they took this picture in portrait mode, so I'll snap one like this, but we want to try and get some more original pictures from this location. I want to shoot through something, I want to have layers in my shot. So I'm thinking take a picture of this light post with Tower Bridge in the background. I want to try and get someone running across. How's that looking? Let's have a look. But, uh, I like the one, go back with the orange, the one with the orange dude. I like that. The next recommendation took us onto the bridge. The clouds cleared up at this point and we were blessed with some beautiful sunny weather and blue skies. You don't have to have super expensive cameras. Everybody's got a camera on their phone these days. Feel free to do this kind of stuff out and about, practicing your photography, framing up, being creative, finding good shots on something like your phone. So, I've already taken a picture of that background. I'm gonna take another picture on my phone and then I'll show you guys a comparison. The next location, we had to cross the bridge and walk towards the city hall. There's a pedestrianized area containing open air sculptures, fountains and office blocks. And somewhere between those office blocks is where we were gonna find our next picture. Mate, this must look mad to people because you've got him taking a picture, you taking a picture of him taking a picture, and me filming you taking a picture of him taking a picture. Camera inception. It's, it's camera inception, that's what it is. And hopefully we can get a shot of a plane going past, but if not, I'm going to take the picture anyway, and then maybe we can Photoshop the plane on there. But the more legit it is, the more epic the picture is. If a plane does go over this, I'll be so gassed. hear a plane coming. We're, I, don't, I have no idea where it's going to come from. I think I, it, it sounds like it's going away. No. Oh, there, 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 there. We're. Unfortunately, the planes weren't going over these specific buildings, so we had to move on. I think I've got my shot. Might do some Photoshop magic. Right, so in this location we found a couple cool variations. So I'm, I'm, you know what, I'm feeling good. I'm feeling like I'm having a nice creative day outside, just enjoying photography. Near Mansion House, uh, this train station over here, there is another location where we can get another shot looking up through like a really reflective building. We should check that out. 
and then head over to a rooftop location which if you're an OG subscriber of this channel you would have seen a video of mine where I went to this location before in the night time so but we're gonna hit it up today anyway just to see what it looks like during the day cool let's go just before we get into our next photo spot, I want to give a quick shout out from our sponsor. Squarespace is an incredible all-in-one website building platform that you can use to build up your portfolio online. During a job search, a portfolio showcases your work to potential employers. It presents evidence of your relevant skills and abilities. Squarespace makes it easy to build a professional looking website without any knowledge in coding. I recently rebuilt my whole site and it was such a breeze with their highly customizable templates. I also love the fact that you can set up an e-commerce shop in a few simple steps it allows me to share downloadable content with you guys why not check it out for yourself and just head over to the link in my description for a 14 day free trial and when you're ready to launch use the code constantine to get 10 percent off your purchase all right we're at a new location if we go down the way to the ground floor and look up we should get a cool picture of all of this reflective stuff come like two steps lower that's it stop yeah right there nice If you are a TikTok fan and you want to see some cool TikToks to do with photography, hit me up. The lit oh, hit me up. The link is the, on the, the bus. username it's somewhere on the bus. here. It's on the bus. No, I'm not. I'm not doing all that work. <laughs> I'm not tracking it on the bus. By the way, I've changed all my social medias as well. It's now Con Tweets for Twitter and Con Films for Instagram. Is this because you couldn't get verified with it's, Pimp Juice? No, it's not because I couldn't get verified with Pimp Juice K. It's because I thought Pimp Juice. This is like a thing I created back in 2012. It's a bit childish. I'm no longer a pimp. I've retired from my pimping days. People have just looked at me very <laughs> weird. I'm a professional videographer photographer, so I want to give off that correct vibe instead of the pimp vibe. You know what I mean? Yeah. This is building. Right, there should be a lift there, around the corner, I think. Berry Passage. That's where you go. There's the lift. Where's John? Hey John! Hey John! Look at the views. Look how beautiful it is. Look at the sky. Oh my god. Right, you ready for this? You ready for this? Go on, go on, have a look, have a look. I think this is one of the best spots. And the fact that we got in here, usually there's like people trying to, you know, enjoy themselves, have a good time, you know, drink their cocktails up on the rooftop terrace. Right now, it's sealed off, and we've politely asked, we can come up here, take some pictures, and what do you know? We could. I'm so happy. I love this place. Oh, I'm well chuffed about that. We managed to get some cool pictures. What's this place called? I believe it's called Cop the Argent. <laughs> oh, Excellent. you got me. Yeah. All right, well, I'm pretty surprised we haven't got kicked off this location yet because everywhere else we've been, and every other like photographer, videographer watching this video who does uh, shooting in public can relate to this, that you get kicked off of most places where you start taking pictures. So yeah, this place has been quite welcoming to us today. I've got plenty more photography based stuff coming out soon. Uh, also recorded a couple of TikToks today just for the fun of it. So if you do want to check them out, the links are on the description. I'll see you guys soon. Are you coming? No. See ya. Bye.
Also, throughout this video, I'm aware that there's loads of other photography spots we can go to, like Chinatown, for example. So I guess the app is quite limited. It hasn't got that many like spots. So maybe if more and more people join the app and then put their own photography spots in there, the app will grow.